Hello and welcome. I would like to demonstrate the how to pre-record your lecture with a Zoom. So now you see me and also your my PowerPoint presentation on the screen. So before we do that, and you need to couple things that enable for you to record your lecture. So the at the bottom of the screen, you will see the black bar with a couple of different menu options. So if you don't see, please move your mouse, the cursors, or the or the zoom area to be able to see the black bar menu option. So in order to share your PowerPoint with your student on the screen, you need to click share screen button. And before you click that button, make sure that your PowerPoint is already open to give you the le to, to give lecture to your student. So when you click the green button share screen, you will see a bunch of different windows in there. So right now, but you can see desktop one and all these things, the default option. And right now I had a, fi a Firefox open and the PowerPoint. So I'm going to select the PowerPoint and you have to select share. So once you do that and the PowerPoint will take over your screen and then do the PowerPoint presentation. And when you're ready, so this menu bar will probably go up of the screen. So when you're doing the PowerPoint presentation view, like my presentation view, so the menu option will be on your top of the screen. So looking for the black bar, if you don't see it, then trying to move your mouse over. So recording is probably under more option and we are recommending faculty member to record to the cloud. Then at the end of the, the lectures and the, you finish it in, they'll be able to send you the link of your recording. So it's more and record to the cloud. And when you looking at it and right now you actually see me, but if you don't care to show your, your faces to your student, and then you see the start and stop so you can stop your video so now you don't see me but you still hear me then you can restart the video so you'll be able to see me your student able to see you too so that's the option you can on and turn on and off and next option you have to think about it is make sure that your lecture is recording so the black bar menu underneath that you will see the little cloud with the red blinking dot that's the indication that you are recording red dot meaning that you're recording and cloud meaning that you're recording to the cloud so if you don't see that why you think that you're recording it it's not recording it so make sure that you have that option in your view and when you're done click more option and then you can even pause your recording and then you can stop recording it then zoom will process your lecture and send you the email and then at the end and you can actually exit out from the your powerpoint presentation view and then end the meeting then you will get an email from the zoom that give you the link for you to share with your student Thank you.